fibrillator, AED. What is its purpose? We have a shock for the heart attack. So this is something that any layman can offer it. So cardiac arrest in the patient is not going to come back just by your CPR. He needs a shock or else an appropriate treatment for it. Okay. So what is the cause according to that treatment? We have a temporary resuscitation. AED. So what do we do? First, we assist the patient with cardiac arrest. Consciousness, breathing, pulse, everything absent. You started compressions okay, after activating emergency. So supposing you are doing the compressions and ventilations, a third party has come for help. All right, I'll let me come to AED kitty talk. So what to do? Ma'am, you can just continue with the compressions. I'll do the AED part. Otherwise, can you help? Let him do the compressions. Ventilation could come and repipe him. Okay, mouthpiece on top. Okay, you can use it. This is yours. Quick, quick. Let's do it first. 30 is to 2. Come. Uh, the chair, top. Okay, so I have come with the AED. So what do I do? First Training thing mode. to do is Call power for help. on. First Remove step, power on. Remove pads from package in back of unit. Up. Plug-in pads connector. Okay, so what it has told me is... Apply pads to patient's bare chest as shown. You can see the position of the pads. Plug in and apply pads. One is on the right clavicle, just below the clavicle, and the other one is... Plug in and apply pads. Remove pads from package in back of unit. Plug in pads connector. Apply pads to patient's bare chest as shown. Yani attache in a summit person should continue. Plug in and apply pads. So now again I need to Plug in and apply pads. Circuit. So analyzing heart rhythm. Do not touch the patient. Heard the command analyzing parameter and stay clear. Shock advised. Shock charging. Advised. Press flashing shock button. Now it is charged. So stay clear. Now if I am operating Press the AED, flashing I shock tell, button. I clear, you clear, everybody clear. This is my verbal Press command. Press flashing so, shock I have to button. Make sure that you are not touching the patient. Okay? Press flashing shock button. Press the shock button. Shock, shock one shock delivered. delivered. It is safe to touch the touch patient. The patient. Begin CPR now. Okay. So this is how we operate the AED. So basic four steps are there. One is first always power on whatever device you are using. Second thing it will tell you to attach the pads and connect it to the AED proper. So do that. Third thing is the machine will analyze the result. When it is analyzing, you need to stay clear. Why? If you are touching the patient, maybe it analyzes your rhythm and it will say that shock is not required. So you have to stay clear. Analyzing rhythm kind of If it is a shockable rhythm, AED will tell shock advised. If it is a not uh, non-shockable rhythm, it will say shock not advised. Shock not advised, don't stop your CPR. You have to continue. Okay. Shock advised, matra. You give that time for it to charge. As I said, we will continue to charge compressions. When it is charged, it will it will say that ready for charge. Uh, it is charged. Illya, illya. Till your patient revives, or else, at the when time the parayinda vare. CPR pin extra kaiyan session or when time the CPR. It is only the CPR the procedure. Then okay. So extra pravashya machine parayinda shock ke na matro pravashya namu shock ke chedo. No, the disconnect ke chedo nahi. Illya. As an EMT, you can only start this machine, but you cannot put it off unless the patient has been brought to a proper setup, a proper care where an advanced intervention can be done. So only on again. I don't know if you have a procedure on the barnet, you can't do it. Okay, fine.